What's up everybody? First video in like two months. Trying to burn 10,000 calories in 24 hours. Something I've done many, many times this year now. Probably overdone it. Yeah, I did it every week in February, every week in March, more or less every week in April. I'm not gonna talk about attempts 10 and 11 because I gave up on the challenges like halfway through. So there's no point wasting your time talking about that rubbish. Attempt number six is when I woke up and started the challenge as per usual, 4.15 a.m. Walked all the way to work, bearing in mind it's early March here, so it's still pitch black. Very, very dark when I walked to work. Did some work for four hours. Walked all the way back, and judging by the footage I'm seeing here, it was very, very cold. And then I had my pre-workout from Bulk Powders. This is not sponsored, by the way, it's not sponsored. And the one you're seeing here is this one, Pre-Workout Advanced. It's to give you a little bit more energy to help you with your exercise. Okay, on this attempt, yet another run with Sam and every time we used to do the leap test or beep test. Then I walked back home from the run with Sam, went on the bike for a good half an hour, did some weights up here in my bedroom while listening to the music. And then literally half an hour later, walked to go and meet James, have a walk with him for about an hour and a half. Got back at about 6.30 p.m. Went on the bike again for about 40 minutes this time. And then for this one, I ended up burning off 8,180 calories. And now we're gonna move on to attempt number seven. The start was exactly the same, you know, woke up, started the challenge 4.15, walked to work, did some work, you know, the usual stuff, walked back from work, took Snoopy out for a half an hour walk, and it was raining on this occasion. So I had to put his big blooming bright orange coat on as well. And then Sam was unavailable for a run this week. So I had to run on my own. Yeah. Ah, this was the week I did some circuit training. So basically I did some a dumbbell exercise for a minute, then got onto the this gym mat that I bought, because obviously at that time, unlike now, the gyms were closed. So I did some upper body stuff with the dumbbells, did some core stuff on the mats, and then did some cardio, so basically lower body stuff on the exercise bike. So all in one circuit training. Then I went for a walk with James, would you believe it? That never happens. Then I went on the bike again. Yeah, now for that one, ended up doing 8,361 calories. Now there are two other ones, which are my two best ones coming up, but they are so similar, and there's only 140 calories in it. Not even that. So I'm just gonna give you a rundown of the best one, where I managed to burn off 8,753 calories. So I woke up at four, this time started the challenge at 4.20, and then this was mid-April, so I was walking to work, and it wasn't quite as dark this time, so that was a welcome surprise. I walked all the way back again, and by 10 a.m., I had already burnt off 2.5k calories and done 15,000 steps. As you can see here, I'm gonna give myself another pre-workout. This time, I used a more advanced one. It's for elite athletes, basically. So I don't know if I have any business in taking this, really, So I'm not an elite athlete, am I, really? I exercise, but that doesn't mean I'm bloody Mo Farah. I just bought some more of this, actually. I use Elevate pre-workout. It's very, very good. Not sponsored again, obviously. Obviously, I then I forgot to record me taking the Snoopy out for a walk, but you can see here on the Strava app how far we went and, how, and for how long. Then I went for a run on my own because unfortunately Sam was otherwise engaged. Yeah, this run was six miles as you can see. And then, this is what separates this one from the others. I actually managed to go to the gym. They'd finally reopened, yes. It finally bloody reopened after how many months? So yeah, I went on the exercise bike and then the treadmill and the road machine as well, you know. I could get a bit of variety rather than just sticking to the exercise bike at home. So after this, give you a little bit of a calorie update, you see, I burnt off by half three, over 6,000 calories, and done almost 37,000 steps. So after walking to the gym and doing the gym session for an hour and a half, I believe, I had to walk all the way back, which was fun, obviously. A lot of walking. And then in the evening, went for a four mile walk with James. And then as soon as we finished doing that and I said goodbye to James, I went for a 4.36 mile run, mostly in the dark. It was getting very dark at this point. And then just chilled out for the rest of the evening. Yeah, 8,753 calories. Thanks for watching and I will see you very, very soon.